Mike Halverson here, President of Shooting Range Industries. Joining me today is Jake Cook, Vice President of SRI. We're at our Las Vegas offices and manufacturing facility where we'd like to share our Ready Range product with you and show you how we manufacture this complete modular shooting range built inside of a shipping container. So join us and we'll share this with you. So here we are outside of our demonstration range at our Las Vegas facility to showcase a ready range. And we ask ourselves the question, what is a ready range? A ready range is a complete modular shooting range built inside of a shipping container. We take a bare, brand new shipping container, we line it with ballistic steel, we install all the range equipment including the bullet traps, stall walls, target retrieval systems. We do all the lighting, the electrical, all the filtration and HVAC. Uh, we skin the module, it's all insulated, the bottom's insulated, the roof and the walls are insulated with a minimum of an R19 insulation. And we skin these in about 20 different colors at the customer's choice with this KNR 500 material, which has a 20 year guarantee not to crack, chip, fade, or peel. We have this outside cover door, which is an entry door with a combo safe lock on it. So let's go inside and we'll show you what the ready range looks like. Here we are inside the ready range. This is a 40 foot module, complete shooting range built inside this shipping container. Uh, and we're gonna talk about the different components that we have inside the ready range. Uh, what you can see right here behind us is this is the air wall. This is where we're getting the air delivery uh, for this range. Or we're getting 75 feet per minute from, from head to floor, uh, moving down range past the shooter, which meets the NIOSH indoor air quality. Uh, as you can see, the inside of this range is finished out in diamond plate aluminum, uh, which keeps it nice and bright and also is easy to clean. Uh, we have a ballistic rubber floor, and we also have uh, all the lightings completed in here, along with we have Sonics uh, for the sound attenuation to keep it nice and quiet so we're not getting disturbing noise outside the range while we're firing. We have a complete integrated electrical system. The electrical system is set up to be a 122 weight bolt uh, that varies in amperage size from 100 to 150 amp depending on location around the country, around the world. Uh, we also integrate uh, natural gas as well as uh, other features for the ventilation. The ventilation is controlled from this single point thermostat. It's completely interlocked all the HVAC equipment together to where it's a one button setup to start the system up. All the fans, all the systems come on and it's all tied into the HEPA filtration, the magnahelic gauges, and the exhaust of the system itself. We also have the Milo system. This is the control console, which it also can be operated off of a tablet, so you can become mobile in a tactical range. You can carry it throughout the range for full operation. You can do laser and live fire off the same system, so you don't have to expend ammunition if you're going through simple training processes and drills with this system. So as we mentioned on the HVAC system, uh, we have magnahelic gauges. Uh, we try to make these ranges as foolproof and as user friendly as possible. So to ensure that the customer always knows that their operation of their HVAC system is working, uh, these magnahelic gauges are how we can tell that's taking place. So we want to have a negative pressure inside the range which we're measuring here. Uh, so if this goes into the red, we know that we either have an exhaust fan or we have the HVAC supply system that isn't working. So this is a, it's a nice way to tell that we have a negative pressure inside the range, which we want. We want about a 10 degree negative pressure inside of here, so we know that we're moving all the air downrange past the shooter, exhausting all the contaminants being fired out of the end of the weapon, and moving downrange and being exhausted to the HEPA filter system. Now, the HEPA filter system is we have the filters up on top of the roof and a HEPA filter bank, and we don't want to have to crawl up there to check them, guessing and trying to wonder if our filters are clogged. So we have this measuring device of Magnahelic, which we're measuring the pressure in the front and the rear of the filter, and this tells us uh, when the filters get loaded up and it's time for them to be needed, needed to be changed. So it makes it very convenient for the end user to always know uh, that they have good air quality inside the range. 
Uh, below that, we uh, also have the option of a programmable lighting system. So when we want to do the Milo shooting and we want to go to dimmability, we want to do different training inside the range, we even offer these with the police light bars. Uh, we can come in here and do pre-select uh, scenarios that are programmed in so we can have custom uh, lighting uh, for each range set up depending on how the customer wants it. So here inside the ready range we're at the shooting position. Uh, this is our standard SRI shooting stall product. As you can see they're covered with diamond plate aluminum which again gives very good durability and easy to clean. It also gives a nice bright finish. We have our standard shooting tray and as you can see, we have enough room here to put our weapons, we do our loading. So everything is done here in the shooting stall. Uh, we're not turning around and trying to do something behind us. Uh, shooter safety is paramount inside of our ranges, and that's why we designed our shooting stalls to be deeper, uh, where we can't get the percussion from the, the person next door. The shooting stalls are ballistically rated for whatever the range is rated for, whether rifle or pistol. We've made them taller so the brass doesn't eject over the top, and we can also control uh, the, the sight light, and we can also control the target retrieval system from right here. So shooting stall is a nice safe place for us to shoot. We have two shooting lanes inside each modular range, uh, and it affords us the, the ability to also fold this tray down and to use our swing out barricades or to move down range. So here we are down range in the ready range uh, to show the different wall uh, and floor treatments that we offer. In this particular range, we have a inch and three quarter ballistic rubber. The ballistic rubber is in here, so uh, mainly for law enforcement, police training, tactical training, uh, the individual wants to move down range, and as they're firing, we want to make sure that we don't get any ricochets off the firearm uh, if there's an errant round. And so if there is an air around, the bullet will travel through the rubber, splatter against the AR plate, but not be able to come back out and hit the shooter. So this is a safety uh, treatment that we're doing with the walls and floors, and we can even do the ceilings in this particular range for showing we have the black sonics for sound attenuation. Uh, down range, you can see that we have this white screen. This is actually a paper roll screen, and this is for using with the Milo simulation system. Uh, we'll showcase and, and tell you about the Milo system a little bit later on. But as you can see, we're projecting a target onto that screen. Uh, the bullets travel through the paper, and that's how it is scored. And when you when you shot enough shots where it's filled up the paper with holes, you tear it off and you have a new, new clean screen. Uh, we also have the standard target retrieval system in here, which as we spoke to before, we offer uh, different versions of the simple pulley cable system to the hard rail system, which we have in here. And we also do full programmable targets, turning targets, uh, uh, with the complete control systems for those. So you can see we have different uh, uh, considerations we can do down range depending on the customer's needs. In addition to the paper screen, which Mike already discussed with regard to the Milo system, we have the, the other key components here. And what you see up here is a live fire camera, a laser camera, as well as a taser and OC spray camera. And those are picking up the laser infrared signature uh, of those on the screen themselves to track the shots. You also have the high definition projector, which projects the image and captures all of the uh, holes that are actually put in the paper, like Mike discussed. Now that we've shown you the major features of the ready range, let's uh, do a little shooting and show you what the fun's all about. Thank you for joining us today so we can share this Ready Range product with you, manufactured by Shooting Range Industries. For more information, contact us at the information listed below. And we invite you to come to our Las Vegas facility for a live fire demonstration of this exciting modular shooting range product.